Hello everyone, thank you for clicking on my channel. Welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. This is your weekend forecast ahead of you for the 24th, 25th and 26th. I think I got those dates right, hopefully. Um, I might be a day off. We'll start with, oh, we're playing a new game, you guys. Brand new game. Um, I should probably put up a separate video for it. Uh, but I'm giving away free extended readings for everyone, not for everyone. Gee, let me try that again. I'm giving away free extended readings for new subscribers. So if you hit the subscribe and uh, uh, comment in the comment section, then I'll put you down uh, and I'll pick from each sign, each zodiac sign. Uh, the latest was published, I think, yesterday the time of this reading um, yeah they were just published they're, they're fresh and uh, for each sign I'll give one should I start this video over again because I'm really buttering this up the website is all rebuilt um, $10 a month for membership gets you all of the zodiac extended readings all month all the weekend forecasts and the week ahead forecasts as well those extended readings and a ridiculously low price for personal readings for the members because I love you guys so much thank you for your support let's get on with your readings. sorry about the I, I'm not even sure I even s explained that right about the extended readings new game in town guys free extended readings subscribe and comment and we'll go from there how's that opening no this is happiness the happiness card a universal energy is moving through your life and your inner being right now while the energy sets all matters of the physical world into proper order it also serves to bring a deeper more profound feeling of contentment and inner happiness be conscious of whether or not you are open to allowing this energy to flow there is a lot of good coming your way especially happiness. Also note the golden ripples that emanate outwards. This shows that your energy shift will have a positive and uplifting effect on others as well. Nice. We have the, the singer of courage and the singer of the chalice. The singer of courage and the singer of chalice talk about the singer of the chalice this is where that was the womb of the universe creation came from where the seed was courage to birth something new in your life something that you want to start or begin or end but takes courage we've got the number 8 and 12 so you want to bring you're manifesting something into reality and not only are you manifesting it into reality, um, it's it was destiny. Like you're not just manifesting it into this reality by yourself. You've got help from the universe. Your guards, your guides, your guardians, your ancestors are all around you and I can I can literally hear them applauding like you can do it you can do it it's going to happen anyway put your best outfit on and polish up your shoes so let's get on with the tarot portion of this reading all cards were pre-shuffled page of air this is defensive energy spying energy controlling energy this person is spying and trying to pick the right time to communicate with you your crowning energies well well the chariot and nine of cups we've you're you could be going on a trip uh, uh, traveling towards your wish fulfillment what 
whether it's physical travel or not, you are moving it quickly in the right direction towards your fish, uh, wish fulfillment, fish fulfillment, king of earth. It's all about the money, keeping an eye on your expenses. This could be someone wanting to come towards you to offer a promotion, a job, a new career. If it's a person wanting you to move in with them, bring stability into the home. Amalgamation means more money, right? Focus. Love. So they want you to move in with them. If you guys are already coupled, you have a resurgence of a renewal of love between you. King of... Ooh. Could have some people fighting over you. Could be the same person. Could be you and the other person. It doesn't matter if it's male or female. Um, it's the energies. The king of fire is loyal. This person is awake. And they've got a lot of passion for you. They may turn up quite unexpectedly. This may be a new love for you. You marry this one. They'll help take care of the house with you. Messenger of air. Yeah, there's a message coming in. And I think it's going to be a message of love. Could be a message of, like, we need to talk. Four of water, an opportunity that's here for you. But you're dwelling on, not in this deck you're not. I beg your pardon. You're looking at this opportunity very carefully. Very carefully. You're hoping it's not just, have I got the right perspective here? Does it look bigger to me because it's closer to my face than the other ones floating away? Or is it just the same as the other ones? Or is it really the real deal? It's the real deal, guys. It was divinely guided. Six of air, you're moving to flowering fields and leaving behind the barren wasteland. Peaceful. That's peaceful energy. And here's a gift coming in. Well, it is the season to be merry. Gift giving season. It could be a gift from a child. It could be a gift from a loved one. or a, Well, of course it would be a gift from a loved one. What? Where else would it come from? Your enemies? Well, yeah, they send some nasty gifts too. It's not a nasty gift, guys. It's something tangible. Could even be an offer to uh, bring more stability into your life. Queen of Earth. We've now got the King and the Queen of Pentacles here. So, this is a union of stability, security, no drama. This one might cause a fuss. Two of Earth. Juggling, multitasking, bringing things to balance. Whoa, fortune's wheel. Of all the decks, this is the most rich. This brings wealth with it. You're moving right into this energy on your chariot. Fast movement, very fast. Clarifying the chariot, we've got the Princess of Wands. Literally, this is about moving mountains, but it looks like you're just barreling right over them. High Priestess, following your intuition. There may be some things that are not revealed yet because it's not ready. The universe isn't quite ready to reveal them to you yet. You probably need to go through the Singer of Initiation first. But you are following your intuition. We have the lovers. So if you're the queen and this is the king, this is your this is your divinely guided. You're being divinely guided together. Your mate. Actually, you know what? It belongs there on your wish fulfillment. Is my love coming towards me? Yes. King of Earth is 
reunion, celebration, gathering of families, friends, strength. You needed strength and courage to accept this love. King of Fire is coming in with this offer of love. Oh boy. All right. For some of you, you're, you're married and someone's in love with you from the outside. And it's, it's disturbing the partnership. I hope there's no blackmail involved here. This could be the same person too, you know. The King of Pentacles and the King of Fire uh, t together in one person is a very stable, strong, passionate, lots of passion person. Logical, but passionate. There is an ending here. There is a message of an ending. Or it is a message of no more delays. King of Wands again. On That's the opportunity coming in. Now this could be male or female, guys, like I said. But here comes the opportunity. And he's watching you. He's watching you. It. They. They are watching you. You could be a male watching this. Actually, this could even be your energy if you're a female. They are watching to see if you take the bait because they want you big time. You're moving to calmer waters. And you may be afraid that this person is a player. They're coming right at you. They're coming right for you. It's it's almost like they're coming in to sweep you right off your feet and take you to the cabin in the woods to have a nice candlelit dinner. Temperance. Making the impossible possible. Working things through. Working together. Finding the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow regaining balance queen of pentacles has needed a bit of a spiritual healing so has withdrawn you know all these people if we're talking about if you're a female watching this and you're the queen of pentacles taking on her energy it could be it's like i got men i'm beating off of my leg so i need to take a break i can't decide today fight it out amongst yourselves Geez, I'm a little bit cocky today, aren't I? <laughs> I think it's going to be a marvelous weekend. Here's the queen of fire. All right, here's what we're talking about. Let's talk about you people who are in love. We've got the king and queen of pentacles and the king and queen of wands. You, We are talking about your twin flame. You know what you want. You're going after it and you're going to get it. Or this person knows what they want. They gave, they, they, there's an offer here. And this person doesn't lose. They get what they want. This could be a business person really successful. This could be your energy. Wheel of Fortune. Wow. This marriage is destined. This union, if you don't believe in marriage, this union is destined. So in... So in most of this case, we're talking about you and someone else. For some of you, you're beating people off your leg. And having a hard time making a choice. But you get your wish fulfillment. So I guess if some of you are hoping for, um, well, whatever you're hoping for, you get it. I'm going to take this over to the extended reading. We also have a Facebook page. We do a weekend forecast and a week ahead forecast there with some inspirational quotes. And as I said, $10 gets you in as a member for a month. There, it, You get access to all of the extended readings. Don't forget to subscribe. Make a comment below to let me know you want to be on the list for a free extended reading. 
God bless you all. Thank you so much for your support. Hopefully we'll see you over at the site. Bye for now.